Like I say, I ain't the same person I was a couple years ago. Like, right. nigga, I done grew tremendously. You know what I'm saying? So, like, it's no need for me to to hold on a baggage or keep, like, even, that's even with me sitting down with Charleston. You know what I'm saying? You couldn't get that. Yeah, you, yeah. You, could, you, couldn't, you couldn't get that out of me a couple years ago. Right. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. 101. Yeah, we gon' talk. Oh, I just thought about something. I be thinking back. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Lil Ronnie was on here. Lil Ronnie, I got a shot Lil Ronnie. That's your boy right there. Mm -hmm. Lil Ronnie was on here, and I kept asking Lil Ronnie about, uh, and you brought it up. I wasn't in the meeting, and I shouldn't have been in the meeting. That's y'all private meeting y'all had over there. You and Say Cheese in real life. I was in Vegas, wasn't mm -hmm. I? I think I was in Vegas. Yeah, you were. Y'all had, had a meeting over there uh, somewhere. Anyway, I brought Sean on, because like I told you, I'm going to get the goods on whatever going on in the city. Mm -hmm. But at any rate, like, when you look at just, uh, when you think about, like, like, like you got Sean, you got y'all, y'all have your meeting over there. What was that damn meeting about, man? What, why did you bring these people together? It Mr. Just, hit that too. It was just really just. Mr. Hit that was over yeah, there. It was really just breaking the ice on, like I said, of me not f with. Cause that, like, did you feel bad about it or something? Nah, this is what it, like, this is what it was, bro. Cause regardless of what they say about me or whatever, it matters if I don't f with a person for some reason or, or don't f with people. When they talk about Dallas, who they always discussing? They're talking about Yellow. Yellow. Like you know what I'm saying? So. Niggas be feeling a certain ways why I don't talk to the blouse or why I don't be like, you know, oh, he'll go to breakfast club or he'll go to such and such. Uh, bootleg camp, no jumper, nigga, yeah. I can tell you all the money yeah. with you. I'm <laughs> you know? And they, and they be like, why, why he ain't in touch with the city? No, no, no. But nigga, this is why I went in touch with the city. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So it was basically like calling them out about the shit that they be saying or the shit what they be thinking or, you know what I'm saying, that I've heard and they can call me out on some shit. We can kind of just coon by y'all talk about that. And just get it out the way and work like work. Do you feel there was a resolution? That's what I was asked. Yeah, I mean, I, I just feel like you know, like I, I, I'm back tapped in with the um, like I, like I say, instead of just going out of town, cause your city still matter too. Mm -hmm. So I'm just you know tapping back in with with the um, with the home team, just on shit. And do you understand? Um, cause I didn't watch the interview or all, of, so I know that they gave their parts. Did you understand where they were coming from with what they to had a, to say? To an extent, it's like on some shit, like it's agree to disagree. Okay. Cause we can keep we can continue to say this or that or tug of war, but at the at the end of the day, I'm obligated to how I feel in my opinion, and you That's are true. too. So if we can just get past that and just move forward, mm -hmm. then that's cool. Okay. You know what I'm saying? I ain't gonna continue to dwell on the on the same. Cause like I say, I ain't the same person I was a couple years ago. That's like right. nigga, I done grew tremendously. You know what I'm saying? So like, it's no need for me to to hold on a baggage or keep like even, that's even with me sitting down with Charleston. You know what I'm saying? You couldn't get that. Yeah, you, yeah. You, could, you couldn't. You couldn't get that out of me a couple years ago. Right. But like I say, I, just knowing what I know about him and, and just actually like people him like he not he not as bad as people think he is. You know what I'm saying? He really a cool. You know what I'm saying? But like I told him, it was just like a lot of shit that he say that's up that to make him don't want to fuck with him. And then the nigga used to talk about me so much. So I, like I told me I, too. He, yeah. After after I had him on here and all that happened, I don't know if you seen the OGs and them got into it in uh -huh. there. Oh they oh yeah, cause you don't be tapped in. I, I noticed him. He'll I, I'll be in my own world. Yeah, I already I heard about word. it. I seen it here lately, but at the end of the day, they got into it in here and, and Charleston shot up out this whole like a bullet and them OGs here and yeah, yeah, the them niggas out of LA. I had them I in here. Know, I, I had I all them niggas that. in here. That's yeah. Went crazy, but at the end of the day, yeah, after just, that, it was downhill for me and him. But we went to Vegas and all kind of stuff. I took him with me yeah. uh, early on in his career, and and to be honest with you, you know, um, it can be I never, about that. I never, you know, I never would, I never, like I said, it can I, be talked about. That I way. never spoke, yeah, I never yeah. spoke about it like in a bad way on my show. Period. Mm -hmm. I just know that people evolve, right? Like you I just say, said. just growth. Like I say, just growth. Like like I say, you couldn't get me because I know like the shit he said about me, so. Once I dress how I felt, he dressed how he felt. Okay, boom, that's cool, bro. Like I ain't like it. What's what's the need for me to keep on holding it? You know what I'm saying? Like if you ain't trying to hurt me, or I ain't trying to hurt you. Correct. Like, you know what I'm saying? It was and some illness like, stuff. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. And he, he he explained to me. He don't make it right, but he explained to me. Man, I respect it. Yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? I respect it. And just like people be like was in the comments saying like, oh, he bought his energy chain. Nah, man, it's just two grown men. Well, 
to say he got mad at my wife for selling his wife an outfit that was about $80, wasn't mm -hmm. it? For the $80. We gave him so many shirts, but he said we, we, that my wife sold, man, they sold up an outfit and I got mad. And I know already it was more to it, but I wasn't for to just even put it out there like that because at the end of the day, like I just told you earlier, my kids watch this stuff, bro. Mm -hmm. So when I'm dead and gone, I don't need to be on here doing no antics. You know what I'm saying? They gonna watch this and they gonna respect what they see because they gonna their daddy was on some real conversation. You know what I mean? With some real niggas who stood on business. As family members, like what's gangsters, you and them boys, you and your girl. That's what I think of all that other stuff. I did it already. And I couldn't have been in that room with y'all that day because my story and they story is all them dudes you had that we all different. Right. I come from a different I'm cut different. Yeah, and and, and and just honestly, like, that's what that's the part that they don't understand. Mm -hmm. You done been to the pen. You I'm crazy. Like, you say you done been to the pen, so that means you know it's still like even with questions you are asked, I'm pretty sure it's certain questions you won't just directly ask. And certain people ain't gonna come on here. Right. You get mm -hmm. what I'm saying? So that they'll say or post about they they just posting. They don't understand the realness behind this shit or what it can start or what can happen. You know what I'm saying? Like, and I was trying to explain them like it's not WWE. I understand mm -hmm. that y'all got it, that's y'all job. Like I say, it don't I, that don't mean I'm agree with everything. But at the same time, like when y'all post a certain or keep on keeping a narrative or some drama lingering, nigga that. Real when it's in the street. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So it's 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 blood on everybody's hands. If if y'all if if if, if y'all posting somebody starting some shit, then somebody do something to them or they do some, like you know what I'm saying. It's like everybody played their part in this right, shit. Right. You know what I'm saying. When you know some real, y'all know y'all ain't supposed to be yeah, talking or yeah. speaking on that shit. Yeah, that is how I feel. Or they they obligated positivity to, and you get what I'm saying. They obligated it. to feel how they feel, but I, I am too. You know, what I I'm got saying? interviews that never came out because of the way certain things would have looked. I got a bunch of those, don't we, babe? Right. At the house, like we not gonna ever put them out because certain things were said. It was federal stuff, all type of stuff going on, right. and it just certain things don't need to be said a lot of times from my perspective. Are we now, telling people don't that, say that? Are we telling them don't say? It, but a lot of times. They'll push that stuff out there, man. It's yeah. certain things I've seen, and I ain't going to speak on it. I'll probably tell you offline, but it's certain things where I've seen even other people not in our state put stuff up that I never would have put up right. because of the way I was brought up. Right. You know what I mean? And I tell them if I ever meet them. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. <laughs> but it's their business. They can do what they want to do. You know what I'm saying? Right. How I, was it? I have a question. Go ahead. Earlier you said that um, when people think about Dallas, they think about Yellow Beezy. Do you feel like you are the biggest artist out of Dallas, Texas? Right now? Ever. I ain't going to say ever, but I'm top two, top three. Okay. Maybe for, maybe for sure. Because when, when people think of Dallas, what names they name? They're going to name you. They're going to name Mo3. They're going to name Duro. They're going to name, now Big X, he getting in there a little bit too. They're going to name, who else? Eric Badu, D.O.C., he really didn't, he, he really didn't rep it up early. Nah, like but first. you got to still say his name. But you still got to say his name. Like I say, even if you want to, you got to say Post Malone. You, Post you, Malone. You got to yeah. say Big Tug. Vanilla, you got to say Big Tug. Vanilla Ice, but I'm saying the main name that comes Vanilla come Ice. Up, yeah. Damn, boy. You, you, got, you brought one in there. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> but when you, when you, when, when a, a recent, you're going to say Yellow. Yellow. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. 101. Yeah, we gon' talk.